Hey guys, this is me, Triple Two Tarot Tuba. Welcome on my channel. Um, I'm gonna do a single collective reading. Who is coming your way? Who is headed your way? So keep an open mind. This is a reading for singles who don't have anyone in their life, or if you have someone in your mind. So this is going to be a confirmation that this person is on your way, or coming towards you. So keep an open mind. It's a general reading. Take what resonates, leave the rest. You can book a personal reading. Everything is given in the description box. So let's see. It's a collective reading for singles. Who is headed your way? Who is coming towards you? It's a quick reading. I'm going to do it for my singles. Love reading or you are going to fall in love very soon or someone who is going to fall in love with you. Let's see what's happening. What's popping for my singles? We have a seven of pentacles reverse. So I feel like the wait is over. A lot of you, you're not even invested in love right now. You're not even trying to look for love or find for love. Yeah, but the love will find you with the two of cups and the death card. So if you are continuously looking for love and waiting for love, then universe is saying with the seven of pentacles, stop wasting, stop waiting, stop looking for love because love will find you with the two of cups and death card. Okay. Yeah, you're about to meet someone with the two of cups here. Let's see. Yeah, a lot of you, you could be working on your money right now, your finances. But you will meet this, this new person very soon. We have the Hierophant. Yeah, this could be, wow, Hierophant and High Priestess. And look at this Two of Wands, bottom of the deck. Yeah, this is going to be a very spiritual connection. You are attracting your soulmate in your life. Guys, yeah, with the Moon card, your intuitions are telling you this person may be around you right now. Or maybe intuitively you can pick up this person's energy like they are keeping it secret from you with the King of Swords. They could be showing you like they're not interested, but they are. There's also someone who is going to express their feelings to you. You have no idea. So this could be a crush or someone who is admiring you from afar. We have a moon and sun. So this is a yin and yang energy. It definitely soulmate. There could be a Leo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Scorpio energy very strong here. And Leo. Uh, this is also like an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have a Taurus, very strong, and Pisces, Scorpio, and Cancer energy, very dominating in your reading. So you are manifesting your soulmate. You're about to meet this person. I'm strongly feeling this is going to manifest from Cancer to um, Leo season. So definitely the month of from June to August. Yeah, from June to August. Yeah, you will be with this person. This person will manifest in your life, or they will come to you. We have a two of wands. It is going to be equal give and take with the two of wands and two of cups. I don't think so. You should worry about love. It is going to be equal give and take. And look at this, how they are, they're hugging each other. So it's like a union between two people who are looking for each other like from, from ages, from centuries. And finally, you're here. You find your soulmate. Perfect match, right? With the sun and moon, you complement each other. I feel you will be very, very different from each other. Like it could be in a looks or it could be you have a different lifestyle. This is also yin and yang energy, so you complement each other, masculine and feminine energy here. But you both are very spiritual or religious, I'm picking up. I'm also saying that you may be, especially if this is a Pisces and Taurus and Scorpio, you're going to end up with this person. They maybe have a Pisces, a Taurus or Scorpio placements or Leo placements, like you're going to end up marrying with them. It's like taking the oath together, like we are together for long term. So this is definitely someone is coming, like they could have an air sign placements too, like air placements like Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy also here. Like whoever they are with the High Priestess and Hierophant, this is going to be a very like a higher level of soulmate connection here with the Two of Cups and Hierophant and High Priestess. You both are going to be priests or preachers, teachers, healers. You both are going to come together and you both are also have some type of a mission together that you're going to help people go through something. With the death card here, I'm strongly feeling meeting this person, your life is about to change or will change. This person will change your life and you will change this person's life. Because I feel like the dark night of a soul energy here, finally the worst is over and I'm seeing the sun is coming out. So there's a happiness waiting for you. You will celebrate your love with this person. We have a nine of pentacles. A lot of you, there is a lot of abundance also coming into your life. You will, you will meet this person when you're financially stable. If you're going through right now some financial difficulties, then this is not the right time that you will meet this person. You will meet this person when you're financially going through some type of um, celebration. You're, you're still celebrating your success or you're celebrating some type of a healing, recovery from the past, overcoming through challenge and obstacles. And finally, this person is here, the love of your life. Yeah, I'm strongly feeling that there's someone coming into your life. You are soon going to be with someone um, who will bring happiness in your life. You will miss start as a friendship with the Three of Cups. Or this is also like fully with the Three of Cups and Nine of Pentacles. And uh, this is also someone that 
could be mutual friends or family also like you're introducing you to each other there's some type of a community involved here friends mutual friends or people are trying to introduce you to each other or you will meet each other through this community mutual friends circles clubs parties we have an artist um, this person could be an artist you both could be artists in your own ways we have a shadow queen yeah this is you a lot of you you both uh, I, I feel like this is you if you're watching this video you still need to let something go or someone go from your past you still need to let the past go and open yourself for this love that is coming because it's a shadow side it's a shadow side of your hair of you that you need to go through some type of healing before you will uh, meet this person we have a knight yeah this is someone who's going to be very attractive to you your knight and arming knight in shining armor like they were going to be very romantic freak uh, there's something with the horse here so they could have a horse uh, or a cat spirit are they born into a horse here of chinese um we are are they on the house we have a cancer yes this person have a cancer placements they could be very attracting soft features feminine features they have they could have a strong body like very athletic body they could be in a sports they pl play some type of a sports they're very attractive though yeah this is a traveler they maybe have a piercing. They maybe look very attractive. They, this is someone who will definitely have a good body. They're very attractive though. Dark features. They could be a traveler and you will travel to this, with this person too. I'm hearing. We also have the stalker. Some of you, this person is already stalking you, keeping an eye on you. Watching you or you will see each other. Yeah, this could be someone who is your mutual friends or community or whatever the work you're doing. Could be on social media too. Like you could be doing something and this person is watching you, especially if you are an artist or this person is an artist and you're stalking right now and watching this person and talking to maybe. So there's a definitely potential here between you and this person. If this person could be a Libra, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Yeah, this is a hottie. I told you, if this is a guy, they're like very, very attractive. Like there's a lot of women around this person. But they're stalking and keeping interesting in you with a cancer here. They could have a cancer moon because I'm seeing here. Something going to happen in the full moon too. Like this person going to talk to you. I will come forward and talk to you. You could be an empath here. There's something about your energy like this person like it. Like you, you're, again, with the moon and, and, and sun, like you're totally different from each other. You balance each other energy. This person definitely have a strong air placements in their chart. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Or you could have it. Yeah, I'm strongly feeling with the wounded and extrovert. This is someone definitely could be, this is like an extrovert and introvert type of relationship here. Like two people who are coming together, they're totally different and complement each other and match each other energy. So that's how your relationship will be with each other. But trust me, there is someone coming into your life and you will be with this person. Now let's see what's, what do you need to know about this person more. Singles, I'm strongly feeling this relationship is going to be going to be come into a union or you will be together within, within next two to three months. Strongly feeling like, like from June to August. Like these three months are very important here for you. Could be in a Taurus season. We have a travel, yeah. So with this traveler and travel, there could be a travel involved here. This person could be from a different place. And with the death card, you need to change, um, pack your bags from one place to another. You will shift in this person's country or they will because there's a proper planning and action needed here. Some of you, this person will come into your country maybe. Or when you are traveling, maybe also you will meet this person if you're visiting somewhere for vacation or you're going somewhere for some type of a celebration or event. You may be going to meet this person there. Yeah, I feel like this is a universe bringing you guys together for a reason. Universe has a plan for you. Definitely, you will meet this person. There's an increase here. You are on the right path. Keep going. Keep moving forward. The honoring path. Yeah, some of you, you will meet this person. I told you when you are successful, when you are at the top of your game. You're celebrating something in your life. You both could be artists or this person could be um, an artist. The honoring path, stuck energy. And we also have angels are for directions. If this is a stalker and someone is interested in you, they're keeping a stock energy right now. They're not sure, but they will make a move here because there could be some conflict here between you and this person that you both are going to clear. Uh, I feel like a lot of you, you're definitely your intuitions are, are telling you who this person is. Or you will follow your intuition, who you want to be with. I'm seeing that you guys are really manifesting your success, your happiness. A lot of you, you may be manifesting a trip. Um, you maybe want to move into a different country. You're manifesting a success and abundance and celebration in your life. And that's how you're going to meet because you're healing light. You're a healer. You're a light worker. You're spiritual. You're empathic. And you're going to definitely, I feel like spirit has your back. And you deserve this. You deserve this type of a love that is coming your way. You are going to be with your um, soulmate. 
Okay, it's a higher level of soulmate. That's what you're manifesting right now. So this is your reading. I'm gonna see you later. Bye. God bless you all.